airplane. You'll be sitting in the front seat. Um, this, of course, looks slower, faster. Right, left, and it's locked. Um, this is the trim, and I'll be doing mess around with the trim. These are the dive brakes, and uh, I'll be doing that. Well, I'll, I'll have you help me do dive brakes if you want. You can put your hand on it. These are our flaps, and they do aid. And I put, well, also you, you can deploy them partially, and they're Fowler type flaps. What they do is they come out first, about halfway, and then they dive back for approach. Okay. So if you're, if the thermals are really tight and you want to slow down, you put on the brakes a little bit. You, no, not the brakes, the no, flaps. The flaps you can reduce the stall speed plus if you uh, actively um, increase the size of the potential. This, uh, you can crank the pedals in with this. Okay, to adjust the length. That's right, and this down here is the brake. Oh, okay. Can you show me EJ? Uh, that's in my, that, it's, oh, that's I have that back here. Oh, okay, in case you have to bail out, right? Well, you anyway. Well, you ain't going to bail out. <laughs> you anyway, this, just in case, yeah, we, we leave it right there. Yeah. Um, we'd, rather, uh, we'd rather that you use the the bag, if you can't get to the bag, okay. Um, uh, it's just, it's a terrible mess. Uh, I'm going to be back here. Okay. This it's lever, this is the release lever. If you notice, we have center of gravity, uh, it's a V-bridle. Just to have a soft, if you uh, release under tension, it wears them a little bit. So we're trying just to have a soft release. Uh, we don't want to gain speed, you know, gain too much distance on the tow plane. We just want to take the tension off the tow rope, and I will. Before we do that, I'll say, uh, locate the yellow handle and put your hand on it, and I'll have you reach forward okay. and uh, put your hand on it. Left hand, right hand, doesn't really matter. Um, but to get into the habit, I'll yeah, that that's right. Because I fly with my, I stick with my right hand in this plane. Um, I fly power planes where I, I mean, I so jump back and forth. Price, right? So, uh, hand on it. And I'll dive and I'll say, pull the release. And I would like you to immediately pull the release and hold it. We'll turn and then we'll let go. Once we've established that the confirmed that the tow line indeed has left the plane, then we'll turn and you can let go of the release. We'll use our energy. We'll climb up a little bit more. I'll trim it slower and uh, we'll go look for lift. I would like to, um, while we're high, uh, give you an opportunity to get back familiar with it. Cool. Um, well, I'll let you put your hands on the controls right away. Okay. Um, you can, while we're on tow, once we get above about 1,500 feet, you can come on the controls okay. with me, although I will be flying the glider. At any point during the flight, if I say, my airplane, you need to return immediate control to me, and I want you to, uh, to confirm that with the, okay, your airplane pattern will be over that house or at the entry point, if we're going to use this, there's another runway here. We'll be at the entry point at about a thousand feet. At that point, we'll do our pre-landing checklist. And F is flaps, and we will deploy the flaps unless we're low. But if we're at our thousand foot Which mark, is a safe mark. That's right. I pull the flaps all the way out and deploy the flaps. The U in Fustal is undercarriage. Sure at down. that point, down. wheel down. We we pull the wheel down and lock it. Uh, S is spoilers and we'll check to make sure the spoilers are open. If they're not opening, we want to know early so we can adjust our pattern. So I'll pull them out all the way out and close them um, uh, just to make sure. A is airspeed and we'll look to make sure that we're within our uh, airspeed. With this, uh, we want to be 40, exactly, 45 or 50 knots, which is a little bit faster than best L over D. We, we don't want to get down near stall speed until we're right at the ground. Yeah, if, you go, if you go too slow in your turn, you, you don't want to That's slip right. down. And what happens when you make a turn? What happens to the lifting of the glider? It slips to the side. Actually, it's the load factor increases because you're presenting less. Less left. And wing on the inside is traveling slower than the wing on the outside. Right. And you can stall it. That could be. So. Um, anyway, we want to stay at that best L over D speed. 45 to 50 knots is great. So, when you deploy the flaps, you also uh, take the control lock off. Okay. And I'm checking to make sure everything is here. These hinges are intact. Look down here. Flaps look good. I'm looking at the leading edge on the top surface. That looks pretty good. Here, 
Yeah. You can look at the bottom Feel air the brake. continuity of it. Yep, I'm seeing that all the bolts are in the flap. Yep, looking at the surface. Probably the biggest decision. <laughs> um, what I'll have you do is uh, climb in, feet there. One of the, the biggest and I'll things. Try not to scoot your butt down here, you're otherwise you'll wind up with the pad right at your tailbone. So I'll try to hold them up. Part of the board. Go ahead and step in, and we'll get the seatbelt. So you're the president now. Should you hold that for a second? Uh, I'm going to run for uh, operations. Okay. Good. Very good. Okay, make yourself comfortable, yeah, just there. Ultimately, I want to try to get like a picture thing here and have some right. distance so that when you're out flying, you can say, gosh, I know I'm about two miles away and I know 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 two miles away and I Lawnmower. Oh, Thanks. Oh, this is cool. Uh, we don't. I don't think so. But uh, we're gonna go up. For okay. Thank you. Okay, as soon as Loyal gets out here, we are going to uh, close the canopy and I'll have you go head right. Can you help me? See that little that little thing? It's gotta what it's gotta go in its Oh hole. I'm with you. Down push down on the window. There you go, okay. Head right. Take up slack. You know how to do that? You see? Yeah, he can. Yeah, I can. Come head right.
glad you're here. Wow, this is awesome, man. right around 40, 40 or under the thermal. So why don't you bring, gotta be around here somewhere. I'm using my feet, feel that? Yep. I'm turning with my foot, helping with the stick, trying to keep that yaw string just as straight as could be. Now, I would like you to help. Gosh, with someone so light in the plane, it's easy to, uh, <laughs> to, to slow down. Oh, there's a little bit of Yeah, let's, let's give it just a little flaps. See if we can't create a little bit more lift.
Oh, come on, we need one. Just one is all we're asking for. Just one. A little bit, not much. I'm fine. Oh Good. yeah, I'm loving it. I'm gonna let you take it. And if we don't get it, then we'll come and land on this other runway. Ready to do a loop. Undercarriage. Undercarriage is down. S. Spoilers, they work. T is traffic. We're the only ones up here. A is airspeed. I'm going to do a non standard pattern. L is look and L is land. So I'm going to speed up. Vibration feels like the real, just like the real plane as you're coming into land. That is so cool. Yeah, this is a real plane. It, it is a real plane, right? Yeah. Do you know how on the um, on the airliners and they put the flaps down, it shakes. Yeah. It brings back a lot of memories. Yeah. Okay, let's wow. open the canopy. 